Morning. Um, I just wanted to do a short little video about um, the things I was printing yesterday. So I'm here in my studio and I'll take you into my darkroom. I'm here in my darkroom and uh, I wanted to tell you about the backstory of, of the prints that I did yesterday. Um, so, we was in Leith um, last weekend. I did a lecture there. And then from there we had a little tour around Leith, uh, some of the more grittier areas in Leith, which were fantastic. And we came across um, where they filmed um, Trainspotter and, and the buildings of where we filmed Trainspotter. So yesterday um, I had a bit of spare time after I'd done some printing for somebody else and I just thought I wanted to try, um, I've got some really old bromide paper which were given to me oh, a few years ago and the guy said who gave me, he said it was his father's and it had like um, been there for nearly 50 years. So anyway, I wanted to try it. It's really old. That's a standard print from, you know, from just an RC print from, um, from Ilford paper. So this is the bromide print. And as you can see, it's from this packet. So it's obviously got bromide silver. Um, it's grade two, so it were always graded in them days. I personally always used to use grade three. That's how I would show me negative, but anyway, never mind. Um, so that's it anyway, and the outside of it really smells. Although the paper inside is, is fine, you know, it doesn't smell or anything, but that's the actual print. Um, and it's beautiful. The paper on the back is like fibre based, it's very flexible and soft. And then it's like on this side, it's sort of cross ridged um, but very fine. Um, and it, it, it sort of prints like fibre base, and it also dries like fibre base although I have flattened that. So it's a beautiful, beautiful print. And it's an absolute one-off. And, and I just thought, um, rather than just do what I normally do, which is rip it up and throw it away, um, it's a really special print um, done on bromide silver. Um, and I just thought I would, if anybody wants to buy it um, as a one-off, I would never print again on bromide, this particular image on bromide. Um, they're more than welcome and I would want 25 quid for it if that's if that's agreeable to anybody. The first person that sort of emails me or gets in touch with me can, can have it. So the other part of it was it was also taken on, on this camera which is a Pentax Spotmatic and I'm using this more and more for street photography because I absolutely love it. it it's you know solid, it works and I've got a beautiful Carl Zeiss um, Flectagon um, lens on it. So, you know, optically, it's absolutely stunning. So that's it, really. It was just that I wanted to, to show you. Um, I've got quite a lot of old paper, all different types. This is obviously a Kodak, um, but I've got some Kentmere. I have some, um, I'm looking out down there. I've got some Agfa. Um, I've got some Ilford, which will be really interesting. Some very old Ilford from the 60s. So I'm really looking forward to using it and seeing what we can get from it. Uh, so that's it for today. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you have, give me a thumbs up.